here also. Hey y'all, this boy talking about, cause look, this junk looking crazy. So Xavier's talking about, oh, it's time for you to get your hair done. I'm like, I gotta wait till I had the money. He's like, ain't your hair like $15? I'm like, $15? I'm like, I wish it was. I'm like, she dyes it, she washes it, blow dry, then she puts the hair in. It's like an easy $100 right there with everything. I don't know where he got $15 from. But so we're on. You want to show what kind of smoothie you got, Papa? I got pina colada. I'll put y'all on to this. I told that. Go get this from your local Wawa. Oh, and also, get this. Get this what cookies. What kind is it? Oh, cookies. cookies and cream. Mm, get this at your local Wawa, too. Yeah, that's. He said it's good. Um, So we're on our way to the church because they are having education day at our church. And they're like giving all the kids like awards and uh, medals and stuff for moving up to the next grade or even if they graduated even college graduates I just think it's an awesome thing because you know certain kids really struggle in school like how Xavier struggles in school and the school may not recognize you but God does you know so it's nice that the church is doing this um so we're on our way to that um I did want to get on here. I wanted to speak about um, Robin, Rihanna, Fenty. Yeah, I know her as, as Rihanna. Um, I want to say, tell you about the prophetic dream that I had about her years ago. So this is going back maybe, maybe four or five years. So she was walking in a line. She had on like a green, like almost like a bathing suit type thing it was green but it was sparkly at the bottom and she was walking in a line of people and I was in a dream I was screaming and I was like Rihanna Rihanna God wants to save you he wants to save you Rihanna and she reached she turned around she looked at me and she was like okay okay so God had me start fasting and praying for her and he actually told me through prayer that she was going to get saved. I don't know when it's going to happen, but at some point she will be born again and she will get saved. So I want to just say this. I know you guys miss her music. I was a fan of her music as well. Um, But the music industry is really, really, really demonic. And it's a lot of stuff coming out about it now. Stuff I already kind of knew, but it's starting to really come out now. People are really starting to speak about it. You can see the signs and symbols. And um, I saw a little TikTok where she, the guy that was interviewing asked her name. And she said, Robin, usually, go back to the old interviews, she usually says Rihanna. But... I know you guys want music from her, but I feel like she's trying to pull away from that because she knows what she has to do to kind of tap into that. And maybe she's going to give us some music that's not her having to sell her soul or use demonic spirits, you know what I mean, to help her to, you know, perform and sing her music. Maybe God is putting her on another path. So we just need to be patient and not like push her into that. Because listen, the music ain't worth her going to hell for all eternity. So just want to say that let's pray for our girl Robin. The Holy Spirit asked me not to call her uh, Rihanna. Because Rihanna is more like what's connected to that industry. But Robin is who he created. So, Robin. But I know people won't probably see the video if I put it. So, I'll put both names in the title. I'll try to get a video of Xavier's um, getting his um, award and his medal for graduation day at the church. I'll put a clip in on the channel. So, that's all I want to say. And listen... If the world don't celebrate you and congratulate you, God will. How about that? I love you guys. 
Have a blessed one. Bye.